uh, we've been given this problem. They want us to perform integration. Uh, they want us to integrate x, the root of x squared minus 3 dx. Solution. Um, for us to integrate this, we shall let we let u equals to x squared minus minus 3. So if we let u equals to x minus x squared minus 3, therefore our integral will be, become integral of x. So now uh, this is now our, our u. And then the square root symbol is the same as raised to a half. So we shall have x u raised to, now it will be a half, then dx. Now, uh, we know that now here we have changed the variable. Remember the variable was x, but then we have changed the variable now is u. So once we change the variable, then we must also uh, change dx because when we are performing the equation, when we have the variable, then we end with the variable. So we must end with the d, the u. So what do we do? We come back with this statement. So we need to differentiate u with respect to, to x. What do I mean? So we you get du dx. We differentiate this equation with respect to x. So when you differentiate x squared, you get you get 2x. When you differentiate a constant, you get 0. Therefore, du dx will be equal to 2x. Okay, so um, so here we have du equals to 2x dx. But if you want to make dx the subject, then we divide both sides by 2x. Therefore, dx equals to du over, over 2x. Now we have expressed dx in terms of du. <clears throat> Therefore, our integral now becomes x, u raised to a half, then we replace dx by du. So dx is given by du over, over 2x. <clears throat> so from here you can see that we have this x will cancel with that x. And then we have our constant here, which is 1 over 2. We take it out of the integral sign. Therefore, here we have a half, the integral of u raised to a half, then du. Then du. Okay, from the integration formula, we know that the integral of x raised to n dx is given by x raised to n plus 1 over n plus 1 n plus the constant of integration. Therefore, for us to integrate this, so we shall have uh, it will be equal to a half. So when you integrate that, it will be a half into u raised to a half, which is our n plus 1, then over n, which is a half, plus 1, n plus constant of integration, plus the constant of integration. So this equals to a half into this would be u raised to, when you add this, we have uh, 3 over 2, then over, all over 3, 3 all over 2, then plus the constant of the equation. So this equals to a half. So when you divide by this one, we shall have dot 2 all over 3, u raised to 3 all over 2, plus the constant of the equation. 
this two and this one will cancel out. So we have one all over three into, we now replace u. What was our u? Our u was x squared minus three. So we have a third into, which is our u, x squared minus three raised to three all over two plus a constant of the equation. Thank you for watching and listening.